learn Funky Shuffle. It's choreographed by Joe Thompson Szymanski. It is a 32 count, four wall beginner level line dance with no tags and no restarts. I'm gonna turn around and break down the dance section by section using steps and counts. We'll then practice the front wall all the way through with steps and counts before going all the way around and doing four walls of the dance so that you know how the dance flows so you can hopefully dance this on the dance floor near you. So let's turn around and learn Funky Shuffle. Section one, your weight's gonna start on your left foot. We're gonna do three walks forward with a kick. We're gonna step our right foot forward, left foot forward, right foot forward, and you're gonna kick your left foot low and forward. We're now gonna do three walks back with a touch, back with the left, back with the right, back with the left, and touch your right foot next to your left. Let's try that with some counts, you're walking forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Section two, we're going to do walk, walk shuffles that are going to make a full turn. We're gonna do two sets of them. That means your first set is going to make a half turn and your second set is going to make another half turn, resulting in you returning back to the wall that you had started at. To start, you're going to make an eighth of a turn over your right shoulder, stepping your right foot into the right diagonal. You're now going to make another eighth turn over your right shoulder, stepping forward with your left. You're now at about three o'clock. We're now going to do a quarter shuffle over our right shoulder. You're gonna make an eighth of a turn, stepping forward with your right. So now you're in the back diagonal. Step your left foot next to your right and make an eighth of a turn, stepping forward with your right. That will put you at six o'clock. We're now going to do that same thing, but starting with our left. So we're gonna make an eighth of a turn over our right shoulder, stepping forward with our left. That's putting you into the 7.30 diagonal. We're now gonna make another eighth of a turn over our right shoulder, stepping forward with our right foot. You're now at nine o'clock. And now we're going to do a quarter shuffle over our right shoulder. You're gonna make an eighth of a turn, stepping forward with your left. Step your right foot next to your left. Make another eighth of a turn over your right shoulder, stepping forward with your left. And you'll be facing 12 o'clock. When you do this, you wanna make a circle on the floor. So you have space to do this. You can make it a little bit big and do a little bit of a circle as you go around. So let's try it with some counts. Weights on your left foot. You're doing your walk, walk, shuffle that makes that turn. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. And those directions are a little fluid. You have a walk, walk, shuffle to make about a half and a walk, walk, shuffle to make another half. So you could use those steps to create the distance that you need to, to make sure that you're going all the way around. Section three, we're gonna rock forward with our right foot, recover onto your left, and we're going to do a right coaster step, right back, left together, right forward. We're now gonna rock forward with our left, recover onto our right, and you're going to do a left coaster step, left back, right together, left forward. Let's try it with some counts, rocking forward with that right. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. Section four in our final section of the dance. We're gonna step forward with our right foot. We're now going to bounce our heels to make a quarter turn. So we're gonna do three heel bounces. And as you do it, you wanna gradually make a quarter turn over your left shoulder. So you're bouncing your heels and it's gonna put you slightly off towards the diagonal. We're now gonna bounce our heels again. That's putting you into the diagonal. We're now going to do another heel bump to settle down onto our left foot and that's gonna square you up to nine o'clock. You're now gonna take your right heel, tap it forward, step your right foot next to your left, tap your left heel forward, step your left next to your right. End of dance. So let's try that with some counts. You're stepping and doing those bounces. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is the end of the dance. Now let's talk about some styling options that you do have for this dance. On that walk, walk, shuffle part, if you or your group does not like to do turns, you can leave it out. So when we do that touch, instead of doing your walk, walk, shuffle, you can rock, recover, and then do a triple in place, stepping right, left, right and then repeat that to the left, step left, recover right, left, right, left. So let's try that with some counts, you'd rock to the side. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. 
The second styling option or step change that you can do is when we do those heels, they're nice and slow. If you would like to make them quicker, you could as well. So you can make them a little more syncopated. So instead of doing one, two, three, four, you would do one and two and three and four and then you would be all set to start the dance all over again. Now, Joe Thompson has a very great option to do it contra. If you are interested in doing it contra, you should go check out her step sheet and she explains exactly how to do it contra when you have a four wall dance. It's really cool. You should totally go check it out. She explains it very well on the step sheet. So now we're gonna face the front. We're going to do it one time through with steps, one time through with counts. Again, those two styling options, those are yours to do. I'm going to teach it with the single heels and that turning walk, walk, shuffle. Weights on your left foot, we're starting with our walk forward. Walk right, left, right, kick, back, 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 touch now your turn and walk, 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 quarter shuffle, quarter walk, walk, quarter shuffle, rocking coaster, rock, recover, back together, forward, rock, recover, back together, forward. Step, bouncing turn, now your heels, right heel step, left heel step, and you're ready to start all over again. The important thing is, on those bounces, if you're having trouble putting your right heel forward, you want to make sure you're going right, weights on right foot, and then you're doing bounce, bounce, and on your third bounce, you're putting your weight onto your left foot. Let's try it with some counts. Walking forward, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is the whole dance. So now let's go all the way around. On the front and back walls, I'm going to do steps. Side walls, we will do counts. We're going to do a full rotation or four walls of the dance. Weight starting on your left foot, we're doing our walk forward. Walk, 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 kick, back, 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 touch, turning, walk, walk, quarter shuffle, quarter walk, walk, quarter shuffle, rocking coaster, rock, recover, coaster, step, rock, recover, coaster, step, step, turning, bounces, weights on your left, right heel step, left heel step, walk, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three and four, five, six, seven and eight. One, two, three and four, five, six, seven and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Walk one, two, three, kick four. Back, back and touch. Now walk and shuffle. Quarter shuffle, quarter walk. Quarter shuffle, rock and coaster. Rock, recover, coaster, step. Rock, recover, coaster, step. Step, bounce. Bounce weights left, right heel, step, left heel, step, walk. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is the whole dance. Now, if you know Jo, she wants you to add some fun into it. So you can add Hand motions in. Sometimes I like to do on those walk, walk shuffles. I like to roll my hands a little bit. You can add some fun in the stance and make it your own. Those step changes or variations that I had stated before, you can do your own thing as well. You can add a little bit extra to that end, make it a little bit harder. The choice is yours. For a lot of variations or how to do it contra, go check out Joe's step sheet. She gives a nice clear explanation on the extra stuff that you can add to make this dance your own. I hope this helped you learn Funky Shuffle. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks guys.